All right, folks, this video, we are going to talk about how to set up uh, OBS in 2020 so that you can use a secondary graphics card inside of uh, one computer to record on. So RX 5500 XT and then RX 560. So that's what I got. Let's go ahead and check out uh, the settings in OBS. All right, YouTubers, so I wanted to do a video on how to record with two AMD graphics cards. Um, I uh, was a little disappointed trying to set this up earlier. You know, usually YouTube is an awesome place to find this information. And uh, amazingly, you know, all the videos are freaking old, right? So if you um, have updated your OBS, which you should, it uh, no longer applies to the older videos. Uh, you will get totally lost trying to figure out how to do this stuff. So, uh, being a good YouTuber that I am, I uh, went and tried to figure it out on my own. And I believe I, uh, I did uh, perform that. So, um, I'm going to use uh, Task Manager so that you can verify that uh, I'm actually uh, doing what uh, I'm telling you I'm doing. So, let's go in here. Settings. Basically, you gotta you gotta bring up OBS first, right? So, uh, if you don't have OBS, then you better get it. Otherwise, this ain't gonna work. Go to output. Don't ask me about streaming. We don't stream that much here. Um, recording tab is the one you want. Now, I'm not an expert on OBS. Um, don't ask me what the best settings are on here. I don't know. Uh, I fiddle with stuff. I watch other people's videos. Uh, in this case, I had to figure it out on my own. And uh, so that's how that is, right? So we go in here. Um, I will tell you uh, type standard. I'm doing uh, MP4s. I've got one audio track. Now here, the encoder, you can do uh, H.264 or H.265. Um, I don't have the encoders or whatever on this computer for 265, so we can only do 264. And now down here, this is where um, this is where you have to actually make a change. So you're going to see basic when you go in here first and be like, oh, there's no graphics card. Uh, and I don't know why they put view mode at the very bottom. It's kind of not helpful down here. But you're going to click on advanced and some of the other ones work so um if you're a master or an expert hey go for it i just want advanced um now all kinds of settings in here you guys can figure out what's best i don't know but uh this is the one i care about okay video adapter so uh, there's a question mark by it and if you hover it over it even though it's not doing it in mine it will ask you which card you want to encode with. So I'm going to be gaming on this 5500 XT, right? Not my best card, but for these videos, I'm going to be using that one. Um, I was tempted to put 5700 in here, but uh, then I would have to change out the power supply because uh, I need two rails and it wasn't going to happen. So uh, I didn't feel like it for this video. So we are going to, um, sorry, I digress. Video adapter, we want to use my secondary one, okay? And, you know, hopefully you guys know which one's your first and secondary card, okay? You're going to play, you're going to game on your, your best one, most likely, and record on your crappier one. Now, you could possibly go back and change these around. If, if you wanted to record your gameplay on your crappy card, um, you know, which is a possibility I will do that because uh, we make a lot of gaming videos. So, I'm going to click on this guy, I'm going to hit apply, and then OK, and then I'm going to click start. So it's recording, and I'm going to go over here to, um, i got to bring this in on the other side. i got two monitors going, folks, sorry. we got a ton of videos. Alright, so... Where, how is the proof that this is recording on the secondary one? So, control alt delete, bring up your task manager. You know, when it comes in, it, it brings you into processes. We're going to come over to performance. You see CPU at the top. We've got, uh, what do we got in this computer? 
Ryzen 5 3600X. He's cruising along. Down at the bottom, GPU 0, GPU 1. And he even tells you which one's which, okay? So RX 5500 XT is a 4 gig Sapphire model. And then the Radeon RX 560, I think that's also a Sapphire one. I get so many video cards, I can't keep it straight, folks. Sorry. Um, now, you can see we are recording, okay? My Radeon RX 5500 XT, he is cruising along, enjoying life. Things are great. He's not really doing anything. No video encoding, no video decoding. 3D, you know, copy, whatever. Whatever this crap is. He is, you know, definitely being underutilized right now, right? Using, um, you see how much of the RAM we're using. So, there's that. GPU 1. Now, this is our RX 560. Another 4 gig card. Way weaker than the, uh, the RX 5500. Boom, look at that, pegged video encoding. So we're definitely using this thing. Um, I'm, hopeful, I'm hopeful this thing can handle it, all right? If it can't handle it, then, uh, you know, we might have to get a better card in here to do this. Ideally, you probably would have a good uh, graphics card to record, not using, you know, some of the videos like, oh, what do I do with my old video card? Well, you can record with the old video card. Well, it doesn't necessarily mean it's going to do the best recording, right? Because... Using an old piece of crap might not get you anywhere. Um, in my case, you know, I may, I may honestly need to use the 5700 in this slot um, just to get good video of the other uh, graphics cards. And I may have to honestly go buy another, um, another AMD card just to make this work good. Uh, and we'll do the same thing eventually for NVIDIA, uh, just not today. And in that case, at least I can use a 2070, 2070 Super, 1660 Ti, eventually the 2080. Um, I haven't figured out which one of those I'm going to get. So, all right, folks. Well, that about does it. Um, I'm going to hit stop here. And then just so you can see it, that it worked. Oops. I don't know why I clicked on name. Date. All right, there's our most current file. And of course, it opened the other screen. Let's try that again. Okay, sorry. It's on the other screen. Um, this is a problem with having multiple monitors. So, of course, I didn't have the settings right on this. Um, my background is 1440p, I think, and it's recording 1080p. So, you see what you're getting here with recording. Um, but it did record, so that's a good thing. Hey, thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe.